All new tonight, an uh, Ohio judge says a hospital must give a COVID-19 patient a drug that's typically used as an animal dewormer. A woman wanted her husband's doctor to use the drug on him after he's been hospitalized with coronavirus for weeks. 10 TV's Olivia Eugenio tells us more about the drug and why doctors say it is not a safe treatment for COVID. Ohio Health says they've had patients ask about ivermectin, but they're not recommending it as a treatment for COVID-19. Ivermectin is an antiparasitic medication. Dr. Joseph Gustaldo is a doctor at Ohio Health. He says he has prescribed ivermectin before, but only for individuals dealing with parasite infections, typically in a single dose that's based off a person's body weight. There is no proven benefit of the use of ivermectin for COVID-19 treatment or prevention. Um, in fact, uh, ivermectin given on a daily basis um, is not necessarily a benign thing. He says it can have negative effects such as seizure, mental status change, or going comatose. It is being used for both prevention and treatment. It does not have to be approved that way. Um, in fact, uh, there is really no science to support that ivermectin has a role for, pre for treatment and prevention. Ivermectin is mostly used Dr. for Josh animals. Meyerson. The District. way we use it most frequently would be in, incorporated into certain heartworm preventions um, for uh, for both uh, dogs and cats. Dr. Daniel Bishop from My Vet Animal Hospital says his practice doesn't use it too much. He says they won't give the drug to just anyone. No one in our practice would be able to walk in off the street and just request ivermectin and be able to walk out of here with it. The state of Ohio Board of Pharmacy has also come out against the use of ivermectin to prevent or treat COVID. In Columbus, Olivia Eugenio, 10 TV News. Now we also reached out to Ohio State's Wexner Medical Center. The hospital says it has had some people ask about the medication. They don't know how many, but do say it is their policy not to recommend the drug to patients.